or the Jenna Samba, you be Sano Cra or Nimu Dimpo, now I'm our credit. So what I say, and a cut across. Sometimes we see some art, a painting. Who did this? We don't know who did that. And it looks like in our part of the world, we don't even give you, we don't even give much acknowledgement to people that do this art paintings and all that. It doesn't always have to be Sika the capital. I need this to start. No, you can start gradually by promoting yourself well. You will get there. Then the government can set in and help us by making all these. You know, um, today is a. a World, whatever, um, art gallery day. We have all um, the artists, the line up in there. You know, models are doing this, and then we have, you know, celebrities. The government is even there, and then we have all these people to help us, you know, build. So let's build here on our own, and then gradually we will get them down. So all that I'm saying is that let's create the job opportunities ourselves because there's nothing that is good than being an entrepreneur on your own. Starts little by little and you get there. Thank you. What do you think or what do you want us to do going forward with our fashion? Because, for example, um, I organize Miss Tourism and I organize Youth and Tourism Conference. When the girls come into camp, they come in with the dresses that uh, we, we, we've never seen before. And uh, we tell them when we first meet them that when you are coming to camp, just bring this few clothes, just something that you do rehearsals in and something that you'll be comfortable in. And then I realized that we are trying to promote Africa. Well, I am. And one of the things, and I, I'm, not, I'm not putting anybody on the spot. Because I'm promoting tourism, and I'm promoting Ghana mead. Even with my hair, I've gone natural. It's not because I have any problem with anybody putting on a weave or what, but if I am saying that we should do this, I should be able to practice it. I'm, I'm saying this that we should all, I don't say that I wear African prints 100% of the time, but as much as I can, we, we should. Like, for example, I see how you have the African print on, you have that on. Look at me, I have the African print, I have a dish. We, we need to blend, I, you know, so all I'm saying is that you, all the designers here, sometimes also um, encourage us, so they say, oh, the fabric is too busy. That's what we have. How can we do it so that it looks good on you? Let us all try to go on this bandwagon of, Wear Ghana, eat Ghana, uh, drink Ghana, read Ghana, uh, you know, everything Ghana. So on that note, I just want to say thank you so much. Okay, so I uh, would like to say thank you to everyone who was present here. And uh, a big thank you to Madam Victoria herself. Uh, Mark Mighty. That's, that's, that's virtually actually um, what happened here. Uh, we had a mighty... Uh, uh, media launch, even though it was very um, summarized, we actually um, had a very great lunch with Vaft Runway Accra. And Accra should watch out. We have Vaft Runway Accra, which is to design the new front line for our forward fashion thinking industry. So basically, um, we've launched um, Vaft Runway Accra, and it's supposed to be happening on the main event. We're supposed to have the main event on the 23rd of November. 2019 and everyone should know that we are working with the theme establishing Africa's fashion tourism potentials globally and this is because we want to have a sense where we can uh, really develop Africa's uh, fashion space with regards to all the designers uh, just as um, uh, Victoria here so um, she's here and she can speak um, a thing or two about her inclusion and why she thinks Vaft Runway uh, is the new thing uh, we should all support. So what do you think uh, is, is the takeaway from uh, being here? Okay, I'm really happy to be part of VAFT Runway Accra. And I would like to say thank you for giving me the opportunity. Looking at you guys, your inspiration and what you said here, I mean, we're going to take Ghana High to the next level and to Africa to the next level. 
I will say thank you to you and you should just watch us out. If I talk plenty, to be like I'm rustling out. So <laughs> they should expect us on 23rd November 2019 for the show. Thank you. Okay, That's great. So that's the CEO of RNV Clothing, a fashion designer um, we have here uh, in Ghana. And she's part of the Afro Fashion Designers, the newly created Afro Fashion Designers, which is only to add value and premium to the fashion space by identifying Africa, celebrating Africa, and also uh, promoting the new innovation of African fabrics, of African fabrics, sorry. So thank you for being here and we thank you uh, for supporting. <laughs>